the Bible to the cross from the cross. Every Bible story has three components. First, God's law. Second, God's compassion. Third, God's miracle. Opening your Bible opens miracles. The Bible as one story is holy enough in our lives. Day 137, Job 22-24 Job's experience of poverty Hearing the word of Eliphaz, who regarded Job as one who made it a rule to do all kinds of evil, now Job only desired to meet God face to face. First point, Eliphaz started to list the faults of Job that he did not commit and claimed Job as a sinner. This was the last argument between Job and his friends. Eliphaz was the first to speak. To strengthen his argument, he started to add lies here and there. Eliphaz started to list the sins that Job had committed. We can see just how much he wanted to make his claim. Eliphaz claimed that Job would have committed the crimes that were made by wealthy people. But this was not true in the case of Job. Later, God rebuked Eliphaz on this matter. After the Lord had said these things to Job, he said to Eliphaz the Temanite, I am angry with you and your two friends, because you have not spoken the truth about me as my servant Job has. Eliphaz had committed the crime of speaking falsely about one's neighbor. Second point, Eliphaz said that it was understandable why Job was being mocked. Eliphaz claimed that Job's suffering was due to God's righteousness. The righteous see their ruin and rejoice. The innocent mock them, saying, Surely our foes are destroyed, and fire devours their wealth. Eliphaz did not actually know about God's righteousness or providence. He just made claims based on his common knowledge. Eliphaz furthermore claimed that Job was an arrogant man, and that God favored those who were meek and humble. Eliphaz, who said the most hurtful words to his friend, really did not have the light to talk about humbleness. Third point, Job looked towards God who was silently observing. Job wanted to hear what God had to say rather than the hurtful words of his friends. If only I knew where to find him. If only I could go to his dwelling. I would state my case before him and fill my mouth with arguments. I would find out what he would answer me and consider what he would say to me. Job knew that the conversations with his friends were pointless. Job turned to God who was silent. Job earnestly waited for God and knew that God was his one and only hope. Fourth point, amidst his suffering, Job searched for God's providence. Job believed in God's providence, but he knows the way that I take. When he has tested me, I will come forth as gold. He knew that God would not give suffering to the righteous without any reason. He knew that trials, blessings, and suffering all had a reason, and that God's providence ensured great blessings in the end. Therefore, although he did not know why all this was happening to him now, he still turned to God and trusted in his providence. Fifth point, Job was able to experience the reality which he could not see when he was a wealthy man. Job was able to see the world from a poor and sick person's perspective. This was because God had enabled him to experience this. Through this, Job was able to confirm that God would perish the wicked, and so waited all the more 
for his trial. A righteous person lives every day through faith. A righteous person waits for God to save and do his work in his time. Let both grow together until the harvest. At that time, I will tell the harvesters, first collect the widows and tie them in bundles to be burnt. Then gather the wheat and bring it into my barn. This Tong Doc app is amazing. When I first met Dr. Zhou, we were speaking together at a conference. And when I saw the Tong Bible and the way he had placed this one story together, the Bible, one story, I ordered cases of this Bible. Now to see this app, the Tong Doc app, ready for you to use in your daily Bibles reading. This is amazing because so many people tell me I don't understand the Bible. And he has placed it in an order as so that it is one story. And then day after day, takes you through the Bible in a way that God's Word will touch your heart so deeply that it changes your beliefs. It helps you to rise up and be the amazing person He created you to be. Welcome to the Tong Dog app.